I do want to go to Kiev right now. We have about two minutes. I want to bring in our correspondent, Erin McLaughlin, who was there for us and heard some of those explosions earlier. You can see she's obviously taking the right precautions because it's still unclear what's happening in that capital city. Erin, what can you report? Hey, Tom, well, we are getting some clarity uh, from an advisor to uh, the Minister of Interior Affairs on a WhatsApp chat to journalists saying that cruise and ballistic missile strikes are underway at the control centers in Kyiv. That is what he has written to journalists in a, a WhatsApp chat. In terms of what we are hearing, we've heard a number of explosions or booms here in, in Kyiv, the capital. I heard uh, a rather large one to my left just a short while ago. Um, at the moment, though, we are still getting electricity. There's still heat. We're still getting communications. I'm able to make a phone call. Uh, right now, it's the early hours of the morning. Um, the streets of the capital are, are empty. Um, but again, people here um, are terrified. They have been staying up all night monitoring the situation. Um, and, and there has been an element of disbelief up until this point uh, that the Russians would go after the capital. But given what I'm hearing and what we're seeing um, in terms of uh, from the, this, this advisor to the Minister of Interior saying that crews and ballistic missile strikes are now underway uh, in, in Kyiv. Um, Aaron, real quick, if you can, if, if you distance, can, can you describe, um, can you like, describe yes. real quick the explosions? Well, they're loud. I mean, it, it, they, they, it sounded like a boom, ex as, as, essentially, um, and there have been a number of them. Um, again, the last, most recent one, I, heard, I could hear to my left, and, and they were so incredibly loud. And in some ways, you could, you could also feel them. Um, at least the last one. There, Aaron Tom. McLaughlin reporting from Kiev tonight on those explosions she is hearing and our team is hearing. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.